So already I created a one uh, VM for this uh, name win endpoint one settings and uh, on the system select network. Uh, remove, I'm going to remove floppy and uh, move up in the order and the, the first option is a network so the boot order will be first which is going with a network then optical and then finally hard drive so click on ok and start the VM press F12 ok So as we are seeing, uh, 1H2168.49.1, so the file is copying from that server. So client machine will load the first uh, boot.vim file from the WDS server. Here we go. So it's about the WDS service. Uh, the color will be the English United States. Click on next. And now it will ask us first to specify the credential. Let's specify the credential of our administrator at mylab.local and this password click on ok and here we have uh, only one uh, operating system image that is uh, windows 8.1 select it and click on next specify the partitioning so for this demonstration uh, on this vm let's specify the partition of uh, 100 gig click on apply click on ok and that's click on next now windows setup will continue automatically Okay, so installation is started and uh, this will take some time to complete the installation. After your computer is start, uh, select the country, language and keyboard settings as well as the time zone and then click on next to continue. So click on next. I accept the terms and conditions. Now select the color as well as your computer name, no specific demo VM. And click on next. Use uh, extra settings. Okay, Windows is having trouble to connect into internet. Just create a local account. Specify with the name, specify with the password, and yes. And that's it. So now we have a newly installed windows 8.1 vm let's click on start select system and here we go so this is the way how we can deploy the uh, os by using wds server thanks for watching this video